Mac read escape. I've got a confession to make to you. I don't know how to count. And I've been watching this program called Guy Fieri's Counting to Flavor Town, but it's just kind of boring. I'm Guy Fieri. Now let's do some counting. One flavor town. Wait a minute. I forgot I had this in here. Elmo's Number Journey. I'm assuming Elmo's Number Journey is going to teach us how to count. Now, I've never played this Elmo game, but I have played the other Elmo games that are intended for young adults. You know, games like Elmo's Tax Adventures, Elmo Awkwardly Handles a Friend's Breakup, or my personal favorite, Elmo Stands in the Corner of a Room Browsing Reddit While a Party Goes On. That is a classic. I'm sure learning with Elmo will be as easy as 1, 2, C. Get it? Because can't count. I'll let myself out. Oh yeah! Bump this! Uh. Uh. Oh god, Elmo! You look nasty with your nasty little web hands. You look like you're made of like Play-Doh or something. <laughs> Why am I so grossed out by this? Like, I'm not even joking. I just feel like sticky afterwards. And dude, Elmo, you're like sideswiping this poor number over here and Ernie is in the background having to witness all this and he's just happy for Elmo. Okay, but whatever. I'm not here to judge title screens. I'm here to play video games. But I'll judge title screens if they look that disturbing. So it looks like we got three difficulties, the typical easy, medium, hard. Now what I usually like to do is I like to... Just picked easy for me, I didn't even touch the controller. What, you think I'm a wimp? You don't think I can count like the other little boys? You don't think I can handle it? Well, you're probably right, but let me pick it next time. Happy to see you. You picked the perfect day to visit. Let's go look for some numbers. You know, that's my favorite thing to do once I roll into a new town. Just look around for some numbers. Hey Elmo, after we're done looking for numbers, you wanna go put them all in a spreadsheet? Or, even more fun, we could hang ourselves. So welcome to Sesame Street. Although, I don't know if I can even call it that because it won't even let you walk into the street. I guess the game programmers really didn't want to do that extra line of code that would allow you to walk into the street. But, I mean, whatever, man. Let's see what's going on around town. That's one! That's one! We can't ignore that! Count is just flipping the bird! I've waited my whole life to see something this beautiful! God, you can take me now. I've seen it all. I have seen it all. Come along to my castle, and we shall do some serious counting. Uh, uh, uh. What's so funny, Count? Trying to get Elmo to go back to your little creep castle over there? Huh? Is that what you want? Is that what you want? Are you waiting for Chris Hansen, Dateline NBC to come catch you? Huh? You want to go to my castle, press one of these buttons. Uh... Uh... This is my glorious garden maze. Your glorious maze looks a bit cardboard-like. I'm sure if a breeze sweeps by, it'll take it off to Oz. See if you can find all of the number twos. Gotta find the number two. Hmm. Okay, so it's that one. All right, easy enough. If you don't have a handy cheat sheet, don't worry. They put the number right at the bottom of the screen for you, just in case. So I don't really see how that teaches anyone about numbers. Now, if you're not sure if you found the right number, don't worry, Elmo will let you know. Trust me. We got it! We got it! We got it! Elmo's got it! Elmo's got it! We got it! If you're looking for a game that gives you a massive headache, well, don't worry. In the famous words of Elmo, I've got it. Have a look around and pick up all of the number two. 
Oh. We're just gonna keep counting numbers, I see. Wow, this is so much fun. This game is so much fun. I've never had so much fun in my fun life. In case you haven't guessed, you do the same thing in every mini game. You just point out numbers, but just in different areas, like the carnival, while snowboarding, surfing in the sewers. I mean, this is literally all you do, and I mean, it's fun. It's just as much fun as getting teeth pulled without Novocaine, or drowning, or being ditched at the senior prom because you smell like cheese. Yo, yeah, Ashley, I'm talking to you. You're not even that cute, okay? I mean, you're like a nine out of 10, big whoop. But I guess there is a second type of level if you're counting the bonus rounds. Yeah! Ah, this is also trash, so that's good. You get to these levels if you find all the correct numbers without missing one, I think. I mean, this is pretty easy. All I had to do is throw in the correct number of balls into this bin. Okay, so yeah, this is a child's game, but you know, it takes a real mature person to play this game. Two balls! Oh, so this is how you change difficulty. Ah, well I am a risk taker, so let's bum this baby up to hard. And just like that, we went from Zachary's hip to Zachary's edgy. Now as far as I know, changing the difficulty to hard doesn't really do anything, so... Wait, what? Oh no. Throwing in math problems now. No, 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 I didn't sign up for this. Now I haven't really talked about the controls in this game, but there's only really two things you can do. You can move, and you can do this little wave hand thing. I just personally like to think that Elmo is just working out a new dance move. I'm sure all the kids at the club will be busting out this dance move soon. Alright, well let's throw this one in. Alright, another bonus level down. Do a little reading while we wait. Are you kidding me? You can walk from LA to New York, go to the DMV twice, fly a spaceship to Pluto and back, develop a whole new language, watch the Lord of the Rings movies extended versions on Blu-ray, adopt a family, raise them, send them off to college, and this firework would still be going off. Whatever's after this better be amazing. This is fun! Yay! <laughs> Why am I not surprised? And that's just the end of the game. They just cut it off in the middle of the plot. You know, what's gonna happen to Elmo? Who was the count flipping off? Will Elmo ever learn how to count? Will I? But thank you so much for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, leave me a comment down below letting me know what I should play next. And don't forget to subscribe because I make videos. Obviously, you're watching one. Okay, why did I say that? Mm. Oh, wow. Thanks for uh, watching to the end. If you like this video, leave a comment down below and you can hit that little middle circle and subscribe to my channel for more fun videos about things. Yep, that's how I'm going to end it.